everyone happy new year so we are in 2020 and i'm doing my first vlog after coming back from an epic japan trip so it's been quite a long time since my last vlog hopefully you have not forgotten about me and i just wanted to share some of the biggest news since i came back and the biggest one of them all is essentially i'm going green um, what does that mean i love green things i just realized that i love anything that is green color and all things green so i love green and i'm going green in another way as well which is to uh, become more sustainable in my eating habits so i'm trying to cut down on eating meat this year for 2020 so i'm going to be a flexitarian essentially i just try to eat less meat and in order to do that actually i was quite successful when i came back to singapore because i actually tried out this restaurant that served up impossible meat in a burger and it was pretty good it was this place called Burger Labo which I checked out with my friend Stoopy and it had the impossible uh, meat plus the Omni Pork um, burger patty and it was really enjoyable as well so I think um, plant-based meat is going to be a big thing this year and a lot of restaurants hopefully will go towards that direction to offer that as an option um, while I'm going to try to also cut down on the regular meat in my life to go for more uh, green options. My Japan trip was good, I got a lot of snacks, got some um, cosmetics. So I'm just gonna try this on camera. I've not tried it, I just bought it in the drugstore. It's by uh, Kate and it's some sort of lip cream. So I'm just gonna try it and see what it is. Cause you know, why not? Okay, so here goes. Huh. Interesting. Okay. So this is the lip cream. I thought it's going to be very red, but actually it's not. Not bad. I also got another lip product, which is called a lip fondue. So it's by Mentholatum. It's called a lip fondue and it's some in scarlet pink. Apparently one of the BTS members was using this lip product um, and he had to hide the brand and he, he applied it like this but people managed to find out the brand anyway Okay, so I'm just gonna wipe off the current one Alright, so it looks like this and then you twist it up Oh wow Okay, this is interesting. It's definitely a different texture and it has some sort of like a candy smell um, and it's very, it's oilier when you apply it so it's more like a balm compared to the other one which is very sheer but it's still a little bit drier though not like a lipstick so um, interesting. I'm not sure whether I like this because it's sticky as well and the flavour is a little bit uh, Sweet. Oh, and I almost forgot. Yesterday I actually received a very interesting delivery and you'll never guess it. So I'm gonna tell you. Um, and it was for a pillow. So Slip With from uh, pillows.sg actually sent me this pillow and it's actually made of memory fluff. So I was actually not expecting it, but basically it's what you get if you take memory foam and you chop it up into little little pieces and you put it inside a netting uh, when it came to me it was like in a roll and it was very surprising um, because it was all like bundled up and I was told to fluff it um, so you know that's what I did like patting it fluffing it and after that it really did grow to three times the size I slept overnight with it it was really comfortable and what I really like is that you can actually mold it to your head um, and it will kind of fit comfortably because it is um, chopped up foam and so it's not very rigid like the ones that you see selling in those uh, very expensive kind of metro shops so this is actually pretty good to just like um, sleep on and I'm gonna test it even further by sleeping on it every night and to see whether you know my neck and back enjoys it or not but so far after one night it was quite good 
which is why I'm going to put it in this vlog. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. That's my weekly vlog. Um, and I hope you will also think about going a little bit greener in your 2020 as we move to a more complicated world. Keep calm, carry on, and thank you for watching. Remember to like, subscribe, and share with your friends. And I hope to see you next week. Bye!